okay, let's get things going and actually import some content. So if you want to add to the library, you go under the file menu and then add to library. And then I've already got a folder of music I've got ready to go here to import. And I'll just click open. And then at the top here, you'll see it's just importing. It's copying, populating this list of artist, album, time, and genre, and as well as song title. And once it's all done, it's doing a number of different things. It's determining gapless playback. So it's analyzing if we can play all this stuff back continuously. It's analyzing the volume levels. It's also tells us at the bottom here that we've got 20 songs total now, 59.9 minutes, and it takes about 70 megs of space. And the neat thing is, is you can just double click to start playing. And you can see the playback happened up here. And scrolls through so this is how far into the track the song has elapsed this is how much time is left in the track and had a plan had to change it by Derek K Miller who is also actually the person doing the garage band video training tutorial and it shows you all of that information pen machine sessions and as well down here you got his album artwork for this particular track and as you change songs it changes artwork we'll also change the view it sort of shows you the albums so we can see actually this one right here does not have any album artwork which we'll deal with in a little bit and then we can also sort by artists and genres and composers and we can also switch to this view which is really cool let's you see all your album artwork scroll through it they call this cover flow and as you click on different tracks it will uh, change the artwork you can even go full screen with this and then you can hit play